When working with 3D models, you'll find yourself working with FBX files in Unity a lot. These can contain material, textures and animations along with the mesh. In this video, we are going to learn how you can use these embedded animations in your projects. We have a sample FBX file, let's add it to the scene. Now click on select and go to animations. And here you can see that we have three animations attached with this file. You can click the play button in the bottom panel to preview these animations. First thing we need to do is tick the loop animation box. Since we want animations to restart once they end. Click apply to save the changes and that's all the setup we needed here. Now we can right click and create a new animator controller. We are going to name it cat since it's going to control the cat's animations. Now we open up the animator window by clicking on it and it looks something like this by default. Click on this arrow in the FBX file and drag and drop the animation files into the animator. By default, the animation stays in the idle state. Next, let's create transitions from idle state to walk and run state and back. After that, let's set up triggers that we can use from scripts to trigger these animations. We go to parameters and click the plus icon in the top right and select trigger. Let's make three triggers for walk, stop and run. Clicking on these lines connecting the states, we can set the transition condition. Now, let's dock the window to the side and see how our animation looks. For this, let's add the controller to our game object and hit play. By default, it starts out in the idle state and we can click here to trigger the walk animation. You might have noticed a delay between the trigger and the animation transition. We usually don't want that. To fix that, we go back to transition and deselect has exit time. This ensures that whenever trigger is received, our state is changed, no matter where in the animation state our object currently is. Let's hit play again and now you can see all transitions are instant. That's it for this video, if you found it helpful consider subscribing and we'll see you next time.